hi fam and welcome back to my channel thank you so much for joining me please do subscribe and hit the bell i absolutely appreciate it guys so we're quickly doing a quick episode review and reaction of you promise to marry me which aired on the 13th of september 2020 so we have a viewer who wrote to you promise to marry me because of she says she's been dating her boyfriend by the name of simtandide for two years so the guy when they started dating they met at the location because of she says she likes to hang out at the location yeah now she's from the suburb a, a southern ville or something like that so they met at the location the guy was all lovey dovey and he promised to marry her and then at some point he even got engaged to the girl but things changed after the guy got engaged to her because of he started now acting weird and not never talking about the marriage they've been engaged for the past two years since 2018 and then the guy has been off and then she also says that the guy has never formally introduced her at her his family's place as uh, his girlfriend so she's also confused by that but she loves the guy very much so of course the next day to group did say you know what tomorrow we're going to take you to your boyfriend's place wearing your white gown so she was also pretty and beautiful you know the people from the show they do your makeup and also they took a girl to the guy's place so immediately when they got the guys like this was such a joke okay i don't know if the female was intoxicated or not but every single one then she was holding a glass of something and some bottles so i think maybe they were intoxicated the noise that was made there when the girl got in the sisters were shocked like girl what are you doing here with your wedding gowns who net drama girl or dramatic on top of that the the dad who is the guy's dad is like you guys are embarrassing me what the hell is going on so they're looking for the 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 the, the fiance who is usim tandile he's sitting down not saying anything so now the family is now accusing u girl for causing a drama even the sisters is like you know what nickel now you and i we don't know each other properly but i know that you are his girlfriend but from my place you know that i don't like you for my brother so i don't even know what you're doing here you are disrespectful and dramatic so on top of that they're saying uh, the fiance must speak what is going on so the fiance is saying yes i know her she's my girlfriend so the family is shocked now that she's your girlfriend what about the other girl who is unomsa and then he's like i know i is somebody she knows about her or whatever but then when they're asking ooh, a viewer that why are you still with this guy because of you also have your filthy things that you are doing she's saying no we are not here for that today you know when you're also caught in your own baggage you don't want to talk about the show she was also like that so the stunning thing is that the family is saying that the guy gave ooh, a viewer earring and then the uh, 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 simtandile's mother is like do you know that the ring my son gave to you belongs to my late husband you are not supposed to lose it i can see you're also not wearing it so a girl is saying that i took off the ring because of i could see that he was no longer serious with me so it was a stop nonsense for something that is an empty promise because he's not even paid lobola at my place so now they are claiming that you are not supposed to take off the ring the fact that you took off the ring it means that you, you took it off because of you now you wanted to go to your favela do you know how expensive that ring is so i think a uh, Simtandile was just hiding behind the fact that I don't want to be with you because of you took off the ring because of when you go out to your fancy places you claim that you don't drink but you, you go and sit at some places they call the spot a joint okay so the other shocking thing that was said there's one of the aunties in the house who is uh, Simtandile's auntie she was like you know what you see I am I am a married woman I have my ring when you are lucky that you found that you found out that Simtandile is cheating on you me I found my husband in bed with another woman but i did not take off my ring so i don't understand that if people tolerate other things they expect another person to tolerate that because of it was her choice that you know what she chose to, to take off the ring so when they're asking okay what is your intention with ugel he is saying that uh, uh, she knows why i don't want to be with her and then the the father is also saying that uh, you need to do right by ugeli and pay lobola for her so the girl is explaining that you told me that you've been saving money what happened to the man uka is like i just sell i'm not going so i you know that i'm a drunkard i drink the money just like that guys like the guy is not even serious she's like you know what i don't want to lie to you guys i am not going to marry ugeli she wasted her time here even the father's the the father of U 
simtandil is like you cannot marry my son my son is a useless dog no no human being alive would marry this guy like imagine guy like, the family is dramatic and they even some of the sisters were even swearing at who are we calling her a rubbish but at the end of the danger guys what i took up from this episode is that you do not need to force things because now she went to national tv to embarrass herself all for nothing it was a chaos people were drunk according to me so nothing made sense hence in jay no one was hearing anybody but at the end of the day the girl did not get her marriage because of they ended up leaving she left no jup jupu crying the guy told her straight to her face that i am not going to marry you and then the mother who is umamaga simtandile said i need that ring back the ring he gave you so you must just pack your things and go and bring back my ring because of tina as was so clearly in the family if the guy agreed to marry U- U- girl, you would tell that the family does not like U- girl because the sister did say that we don't like you you have your own things and so when they left they were all like hamban 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 and funegila like it, it was so sad guys it was so sad it was so sad because of girl wasted a whole time of her life for something in your but i feel like she was also hiding something because when they asked her that you know why i don't want to marry you you have your deeds she always kept on saying like uh uh-uh, we are not here for that so someone is clearly lying here but at the end of the day the moral of the story is that you do not need to force circumstances or situations if someone is serious about you they will do that but then yeah, the family was so rude to girl they chased her away like a dog like i'm saying clearly even if she was married to the family she was going to be treated badly because of they don't like her anymore and the guy in jay's person who was like mina i drink so unje you are wasting your time with me i drank imali mina yama lobola even the family is calling the guy udoko so unje, it was a whole lot of drama guys anyway that's it for today's review please do like comment subscribe and i'll see my next live video chat for now Any gossip now? Eh?